All right, Knights of Apollo, what is up, guys? It's another beautiful day in Kingdom Come Deliverance, and adventure awaits. Let's go ahead and, uh, oh, there's no food for us. Curses. Uh, but we should have our armor on. We're good to go. Uh, we're gonna go and keep on killing cumins. I think what we should do here, since it's... These are the cumins? Yeah. So the cumins are up here. We might as well go talk to this area and find Matt and Fritz a job. Uh, since, you know, it's kind of on the way, even though we could just fast travel, but it's fine. We'll go over here and just complete this. Hopefully it's an easy, like, oh, okay. You know, here you go. Uh, but it's a new day, so where's Mutt? Muddy boy? Where's Mutt? Oh, there he is. I was like, uh-oh. He's not going to be chilling with us. All right, so let's feed him. Got for you. It's a new day, so I feed him at least once a day. I don't know what the standard is. All right, eat that. Like, I don't I don't know, like, how much he needs to eat, but... Good boy. And then let's, let's praise him. There's a good doggy. There's a good doggy. That's my boy. Alright, so, perfect. Let's go and get on pebbles. Wait, is this our compost or something? Look at the compost. Oh, they even have, like, dead animals in there. Skulls and stuff. Interesting. Okay, uh, so we need to get some food. <laughs> uh, I'm just gonna go to the guards. I feel quite hungry. I know, Henry. I'm gonna go to the guards and get some food there. Where they have their little, like, hangout. And then from there, we're going to go and get Fritz Fritz and uh, Matthew job. I always, man, I'm always so excited to record these. I try to do once or twice a day, like I'll record an episode. Like one, not once or, I record an episode, like one episode, sometimes two. If I'm feeling extra special, I'll do uh, three episodes in a day. I don't like to do that though, because by the third episode, I, I don't have as much focus. You know what I mean? Like it just, I'm not paying attention as much. Um, but yeah, so uh, I'm just always looking forward to recording these episodes and I get so saddened when I feel like I've been playing for like, what, five minutes and then I look down and it's been 55 minutes. I'm like, oh my God, like how did this happen? So we wanna go around here, I think. No, that's, yeah, 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 this is yeah. fine. So we've eaten, but we're probably going to be hungry again soon because we're, we're pretty hungry. But we're just going to fly by here and just follow the road, which will hopefully take us to the green areas where we need to go. And a couple things, you know, at this point, I'm just saving my money. Uh, I know some people have been wanting me to buy a new horse or buy this or buy that. At this point, I'm just saving money. And the reason I'm doing that is to rebuild um, that certain village, if you know what I'm talking about. If you don't know what I'm talking about, you'll see later. But I'm just saving my money. I think right now, the equipment I have is more than enough. And I will be able to get through, you know, whatever I need to get through with this equipment. It, and then once we establish the town, then I will definitely um, look into, um, you know, getting more stuff. Uh, man, you know, Pebbles has been yeah. doing a pretty good job of keeping his fatigue up. All right, we got a new town we just discovered. It's not a major town, but it is a town. And there's a side quest over here. We definitely want to be doing some side quests soon, but I'm very content on just killing humans. <laughs> killing humans, collecting their gear. Oh, there we go. All right, easy, Pebbles, easy. Anybody here looking for a job? Or workers? Not looking for a job. Discovered an archery range. Fast travel point. Hell yeah. Yep, here we are. We've made it. Hello. 
Good day to you. What do you need? I've heard that you could use some help. Teresa, the mill maid, sent me. She says He's like, oh, Teresa, is she asking Five about me? Pairs of hands would be useful. What do you have in mind? My friends, two survivors of Scalitz, are looking for work. And why should I take them? They're experienced carpenters. Why not? Carpenters would be helpful. There's a lot of work here at the mill, and I'm not as spry as I used to be. Thomas, my foreman, tries his best, but he ain't up to that kind of work. But they aren't idlers and drunks, are they? I only take in people who are willing to do hard, honest work. Uh, they're basically my neighbors. I know them personally, and they've always done a good work. You know me. I'm from Scalitz, and I know them both personally. They worked in the royal mines, and their master couldn't praise them highly enough. In the Scalitz mines? But that's skillful work. I'll I, ho glad to I hope this does a backfire. Hell, I'll give them a chance. We'll talk about pay and a roof over their heads when they get here. Good luck to you. There we go. Perfect. Um, I don't know what that's going to do for us. Oh, we got to tell them now. That makes sense. All right. Well, let's just finish that. They're kind of they're kind of nearby, so right? This is where No, no, no. That's not That's not Fritz. Where's Fritz? Where are they? They what what city were they at? They were they were at I think they were at Ushits, right? Yeah, I'm pretty sure they were. So we need to go there anyways, but I'm surprised. Oh, wait, no, they're over here. Whew. Good thing we didn't go that way. They're at Sasau. That's right. Um, Let's fast travel here. So let's go tell them about that, and then we can go kill the uh, Cumin uh, Bandit camp. This is good bandit area. Nope. Usually surrounded by trees is when you get attacked. I don't, I honestly, I don't really know. I'm just thinking like, hey, if I was a bandit, I'd pick somewhere in the woods, you know, to attack someone. But I'm not a bandit, so. And we could always see if there's a, um, what do you call it? A scribe here. Because we do need to get some yeah. more books. went the wrong way it's all right we can kind of cross here oh boy sakra it's hellishly deep here all right all right we'll go back we gotta we gotta find the um correct road get over there i think it's over this way yeah excuse me ah sasau The Miller and Ledechko would be happy to meet you. You really found work for us? Of course. Yeah, so get off your ass and go to work. Sour faces of yours a moment longer. Thanks, Henry. Only... <sighs> what? The reward we talked about? Well, we haven't got two Groshen to rub together. <sighs> You'll pay me next time. Nah, that doesn't matter. You'll pay me when you have it. That we will. Stop by and visit us in a week. We'll pay you back as soon as we get our first wage. What kind of training does he do? Stealth. I'd like you to teach me how to be better at stealth. Certainly. But it'll cost you. <laughs> I'd like to practice the basics. All right, but it'll cost you. <laughs> you jerk, dude. I got you a yob. Now, pay close attention. Good luck, then. All right, my stealth has improved. Might as well, you know, I, I've got the money. I might as well spend it and improve upon that. All right, so they're going to go do some jobs. In a week, I guess we can get some money out of them, so that's good. All right, so let's fast travel up here. We're going to go deal with the bandit camp. Uh, is there anything else we need to do? Uh, I think that's it. There's a DLC quest. We'll do that later. All right, so it looks like we're going to some new a new path we haven't gone before. 
But yeah, the bandit camp should go smoothly. We're going to get a lot of loot from it. And we'll be able to uh, sell that. And just keep uh, keep making more money. We're at 4K. We're at 4,000. So um, we're doing very, very good with money. It's really not too difficult to get money in the game. It's just that initial snowball. You just got to get it going. You just got to start rolling. And then you'll start really building up that snowball and making a ton of money. You know, once you buy everything you need... And then you'll get a ton of money and then you'll get to a point where you just you know um you just get what you don't need <laughs> you know you just get extra accessories when you have so much money i guess that's a hard thing to balance in an rpg is uh you know making sure that there's stuff for you that you can always buy you know that you could always save up and buy um, but it's tough. It really is. And, it, you know, they, it would be lame for them to scale it. You know, like the game sees that you have, like, you know, 100,000 coins. So they make, you know, certain items way more expensive than they should be. You know, just scaling the currency. Obviously, that's not a good fix. That's a lazy fix. But if they had some sort of um, some items that were just uber expensive, like maybe you could buy... Uh, a house or I don't know. I mean, I, I really don't know All right, so we're gonna dismount. Oh See I'm hungry dang uh, I wonder if there's any food I definitely I mean I should still be able to win some fights here I don't think we're gonna need a lot of food bread roll we can eat that Smoked sausage. Uh, we'll go ahead and eat that. That uh, really... Yes, human dustbin. He's eating a snail. Alright, so let's find the camp first, and then we'll go into battle mode. Oh, there's a human right there. Alright, battle... Oh! What, are they patrolling? Oh, did I not sharpen my sword? I didn't. Monotolaki. Damn it. Ah, oh, damn it. I misclicked. Stop! Holy shit. Did I just one hit this guy? Now, oh, is this your friend? Huh? <laughs> Very sick. Come on. Ow, what was that? Oh, God. Okay, this isn't good. All right, warfare went up. Uh, what? They have a dog? Uh, who's hurting butt? Alright, alright. Boss Not good, not good. Not good, not good. Alright, this dog's gotta go. Whoa, what's going on? The fence went up. Good news, I'm going to have lots of ears. No, no, no. 
I don't. I, oh, do we? Oh, we almost got them all. Yeah, we're we're really strong, guys. Oh. No, no mercy. Where was the mercy for my family? Okay. That wasn't as clean as I wanted it to be, but nonetheless, we did it. And we have so much freaking loot. Oh, let's take it all, baby. Let's take it all. You can never have enough. Take this. Human axe. Okay, what else do we got here? Where's everybody else? I know there's more than three. We killed like five of them, I think, at least, so. I think there's another body over here. Yep. Oh my god, we're gonna have so much money, it's ridiculous. And then here's the last guy, I believe. Yeah, this I believe this is the first guy we killed. All right, so we are like full, 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 full of items. All right, so we need to move all of... Well, first off, we have a sword upgrade. Heck yeah, this is another um, combination thing. This is the doubling. All right, we definitely want to learn this. Cool. Another combo for me to learn. And then... Oh, let's, we're not done. We need to move our inventory over so we'll move everything that we don't use which is a lot of stuff well this cumin metal shield is actually pretty good i don't use a shield though all right that's everything and let's move all this armor Remember, we don't need to keep any of this because we have our cumin outfit. No, I don't want to wear that. Wait, what happened? Am I not wearing clothes now? Put those back on. Not that it really does anything for me. Hopefully the horse can can handle all, all of this. Ooh. Knight spurs. Ah, horse can't carry anymore. Ooh, look at this one. I mean, I'm not going to wear it, but dang. Can you carry this? No. It looks like it's... Looks like the horse is full. We unfortunately still have a lot of stuff. So, I'm just gonna drop, unfortunately. Actually, this is worth a thousand. Oh my god, I better not drop this. <laughs> that would have been bad. Here, let's do it based on price. We're keeping that. Um, I guess we'll just drop this. There we go. That's, that's all we had to drop. All right. All right. <laughs> Poor Pebbles is like, <gasps> just like full of like gear, just trying to get back. Okay, so we just need to go to Townburg. We'll sell the, we'll get our contract money and then we'll go back all the way to Rate. Or we could go, I bet we could sell some stuff at Sasau. We also need to get some books. You know what? Let's stop into Yushits. I bet we could sell some stuff there too. All right, so we'll go to Townburg. That way it's a little bit more efficient, you know? And Townburg, here we go. We'll get our money for um, killing the camp, clearing the camp, and then the ears. That's going to be a nice plus of money. Also, guys, we made money just of like collecting gold off of the humans. So he's over here. I've got some goodies for you, buddy. Excuse me. 
I'm glad to see you. I'm glad to see you too, bud. I've taken care of that camp. Have you brought me proof? Here it is. Well, that is a fine bit of news. Some farmers from Ujits came to the castle with a complaint. There's another encampment to the east of the village. Very well. I'll take Oof. a look. Back. More loot. All right, and then hand over trophies. Have some trophies. Show me. Good work. That's the way to deal with this. Five cumin ears. Nice. 175 groschen. That's it. Okay. Well, that's done. Now it's time for us to fast travel to over here. Just don't ask questions. Oh, we're overloaded. What? How can that be? We weren't... We didn't pick up anything. All right, let's go to the inventory. We might have to drop. What? Oh, I guess because we're injured. All right, well, let's just drop this. We'll drop another one. There we go. Okay, now we're good to go. Yeah, we lost a, what, like 20 coin or something. I know it says that it's valued at 100, but you never get 100 gold for selling it to people. Oh, Henry, taking your sweet time going through that, that outer, uh, what is that, Moton Bailey? It's almost nighttime, so it might be too late. Radishes, carrots, and apples that well, it's the light's still out. Let's see, where's the scribe at? So we want to go... The scribe and also the trader. We could sell some stuff at the trader. So let's go to the trader and see if we can sell some items. I mean, I'm sure he's going to buy it. Good day to you. What do you need? Let's talk trade. I want to sell anything that... So we're gonna put anything we couldn't fit into the horse's inventory. He's got, he's got, wow, he's got 5k. So he, he should be able to buy all of this off of us. Are these better? No. The silver spurs. Only 195 to him, huh? Even though they were valued at 100. All right, that's everything we're carrying. So 500 gold, sounds good. <coughs> Reputation gained. So that clears up some space. So let's go to the scribe now. So he's over on the, pretty much the other side of the building. We're gonna go see if he has any books for us. Is this him? I think so. The feather is giving it away. Is it locked? Oi! You got any books for me? Good health to you. Let's talk trade. Oh! Okay, he does. The only thing is, like, how do we. On tournaments and nightly joust. I, I don't know, like, I assume the more expensive ones are the ones that teach you stuff. Oh, yeah. Only read after achieving level 5. Perfect. Perfect. Okay. We're level 5 in reading, right? We should be. So we're going to add this to basket. And we could sell... Can we, oh, we can't sell any of the books. Uh, I guess, well, I'm holding on to all their books. Okay, close the deal. Nice. I'm going to sit down here and read for a few hours. All right, let's read our new book that we can absolutely read because we have a high enough level. We should. Nice. We can read the whole book in six hours. Let's go. So 
So we want to try to level this up so we can read the other books as well. I don't know, like, it's pretty difficult to find books that are low level. Woo! Does this, was that purely just for reading? Like improving our reading skill? That's pretty good. Uh, let's see. What is what level does this have to be? Oh, we can read. We can read the joy of gutting, as well. How did we not read that before? Okay, so let's go to player. Go to our skill here. Reading, horsemanship. Let's see. Reading. Yes. Let's see what these are. Uh, if you're sitting comfortably, you get a double reading bonus. Avid reader, the, your level of study of the book you've read most will, um, wait, the level of study of the book you've read most of will advance automatically while, while sleeping or skipping time. Okay. Well being learned, you make a better impression on people and get a plus one speech bonus when trying to persuade a guard. That seems pretty useful. So we'll, we'll get the plus one speech. You never know when you're going to need that. So we'll go with that. Nice. Um, hey, well, let's read The Joy of Gutting. What? What do you mean? You can only read after acquiring level five? What? Our reading is level seven. You haven't reached the skill level needed. What are you talking about? You can only read after achieving level five. What? How? What? Huh? Uh, I'm level seven. Level 10, level 15. God, this... Okay. Well, we need to find a place to sleep because we are injured. And it is the middle of the night, so I don't think we're going to find anywhere to sleep. Is this... Well, is this a bed? I'm trespassing, though. Is he sleeping on a bench? Well, I can sleep here next to him. <laughs> no, I'm trespassing here. I don't I don't want to get in trouble. Especially from the scribe. Oops. Don't want to do that. Well, I don't think we're going to find a bed here. What we could do though, is work on our lock picking. We just need to go to a door that's locked and then just run away. So that's going to help our lock picking. Man, what? There's some food there. Is there anybody who locks their doors? Oh, here we go. Perfect. We'll see what's in it, but... Nothing. <laughs> Nothing worthwhile. We should probably put the torch away when I'm doing something illegal. Okay, that's another easy lockpick. Nope, nope, that's not the torch button. Here we go. Oops, that's gonna alarm some people too. There's Pebbles. Look at Pebbles, he's on his way. Nothing. Nothing. It was nothing. So there we go. This is how we do it, guys. This is uh how we go about our day. Uh this is the inn. But 
it's locked because it's way too late. All right. I don't think we alerted anyone that time. <laughs> Did you guys hear those people? What the hell was that? I mean, that's probably the correct response, you know? Sounds like they're up over here. Very easy. What the hell was that? Okay, I don't... Oh, he's opening it. That's why. Let's get out of his yard. Yeah, so if we are loud, and we're very loud. I mean, we're wearing heavy armor. What was that? I don't know. Hey, be careful. I think there's somebody out here trying to break into people's houses and taking nothing. Oh, man. Yeah, it's, I, I'm on the lookout. Don't worry. Don't you worry. I'll find them. I'm keeping this neighborhood safe. <laughs> Alright. Let's turn this off. Oh, that's not locked. All right, well, we got a couple doors there, you know? It helped out a little bit. Lock picking's pretty easy. Yeah, I think it's better to kind of go around with uh, light armor or no armor. Kind of helps with that stuff. I think we've already been here. Yeah. All right, so we'll wait. I guess we're gonna be pretty tired yeah 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 let's go we'll just wait until sunrise I really don't know why guys we couldn't read that book it said level five we were level seven I don't know what's going on if it glitched out or what or maybe we've just read too much our maximum amount but we gained two levels reading that other book okay that's fine uh let's also since we just got from a battle sort of when we fought those humans we should go and try to repair everything that we can before it's not possible oh nice we repaired everything Well, unfortunately, we can't repair that, but that's the least of my... The the Taylor stuff is the least of my worries. Now, is there a grindstone? There's probably a grindstone somewhere. Well, we got that repaired. We definitely need to get some sleep. So, I, I know we're, our sleep pattern here is going to be thrown off, but... I'm going to go into the this area and get a nice couple hours of sleep come here i want to talk to you jesus christ your clothes were you assaulted damn okay yeah all right you that's just passive aggressive is there somewhere i could ah there's room here for how long uh for one just night one night all right two gold come on no. here you are You've got it all to your Alright. Where's my bed? Where do I go to sleep? You'll have no trouble finding it. Right, right inside, inside the door, the door to, the building, to the building. There's a ladder, ladder up to the loft. loft. Your yeah. bed's ready. Alright. May the Lord watch over you. Thank you. Let's head to the right. Uh... Maybe over here? Oh, yeah. That's just at the right. Ah, some much needed sleep. 
And we'll sleep until our energy's 100. So a little past noon. So we'll still have a, a good chunk of daylight to get some stuff done, which of course is going to be killing some cumins. And we also need to feed um, our good boy. We also need to eat. That won't be a problem. All right, so cancel. We're a hundred. Hundred. A good nap. Keep us energized. And also we let our wounds heal. And let's get some food. Mutt's probably pretty hungry too. Mutt, do we have food for him? Bacon. You're baking me crazy. Alright, so here, food. Look what I've got for you. You'll love this. Bacon, buddy. Eat up. Mmm, you're spoiled. Spoiled, spoiled. Fresh cooked bacon. Okay, not super fresh. Good fella. That's my boy. That's my boy. Alright, let's end dialogue. Hound, Houndmaster leveled up, so that's good. We want to go to the trader again, because now that I realize, if we go, because the bandit camp's over here, we're going to have so much loot we need to pick up, and we have a ton of loot. So we should just go to the trader and try to sell as much as possible. We could even Apples, sell... Oh, melon, Apple! Rock. Apple! Jesus! Right, even the horse knows. He's like, no, I'm not going anywhere until you sell this crap. Alright, so... Let's get the inventory, and we're just gonna take all this stuff. Okay. Oh, it's just got a huge sack of just armor clanking. They walk into I here, just throw it on the ground. How much for all this? With you. So he still has 5k. So let's get selling. Oops. No, I want to sell all of it. Nice. Nice that we could... Sell all that stuff. Why is it in the red? Oh, that's my wealth. Oops. Dang it. Alright, well, give me this back. He only has 200 gold. <laughs> I'm the rich man. Okay. Whatever. That's fine. Yeah, just take it. Okay, well, I guess we go back to Rate. I know that's inconvenient, but it is what it is. We're gonna move all this crap back. Sorry guys, I know this isn't the most riveting of gameplay. Okay, that's everything. Let's go, Pebbles. Garlic! Garlic. Alright, so we're gonna travel all the way back. Because Rate is where it's popping, you know? That's that's where you make the good money. That's where the, uh, the shopkeepers have all the coinage. Which you can sell all that junk to them. And hopefully they're making good money from all the uh, cumin items I have. At the very least, you could break them down and... Uh, make better armor if you don't you know obviously people don't want to buy cumin armor because well they don't like the cumins and they don't want to look like them uh, but yeah they're hopefully making some good money from my business a pilgrim well we should definitely talk to the pilgrim because you never know he might have a book to read what's it about I have a wonderful offer for you all right. Show me the goods. Show me what you're selling. 
Yes. Boo. All right. Well, I'll just I'll take it. But <sighs> dang it, dang it, dang it, dang it. We gotta get our reading level up. It's close, but we gotta find a couple more books. Couple more books. All right. Let's keep going back. Hey, I don't know if we're going to get there in time. It's going to be close. They might close up shop. Yeah, I think they're going to close up shop. When do they close? So it's... No, eight. Yeah, I don't think they're going to be open. Dang. We can try. But I guess we'll just go to sleep at Teresa's. And try to read again. The sun's still out. Yeah. Ah! Excuse me, this is urgent. I have a saddle bag full of armor. Good people, come up close. No! All right. Fresh bread. Fresh bread. Fresh bread. All right, cool. We're still gonna be able to sell. So, once again. All that. Do I have a God, deal for you? What happened to you? All right. I need to get my stuff repaired. Uh, let's talk about trade. You have four thousand. I'm wealthier than him now. <laughs> Maybe wealthier than his store, I suppose. Making fat stacks, baby. Fat stacks. Let's go. Okay. 2.5k. Let's haggle and I'll I'll make Let's it a little bit cheaper for him. Aye. Yes, let's talk about the price. I'll do... Look at that. I'll make it that much cheaper. That much cheaper. Here. And, uh, something for your trouble. My word. Thank you. Thank you kindly. I'm gonna quickly go to the tailor. Get my stuff repaired. I'm glad to see you. I'm glad to see you. I can clearly tell you need repairs done. Close the deal. Okay, well, hopefully people will stop looking at me and being like, My God, sir. My God, sir. You look like you were attacked. Yeah. I gotcha. All right, so let's go back. We'll just fast travel. It's faster. And we'll read. Hopefully. We're level seven. We're level seven. The book says level five. We should be able to read it. So someone brought up that I didn't read the Hercules book all the way. So I'm going to take that again. Try reading it. Anything I can do to level level me up. I guess I can just sit on the bed and read. Hey, Teresa, how's it going? All right, time to read, yo. Time to read. Oh, Hercules, Hercules. Read it. You've already read this book from cover to cover. Okay. That's what I was afraid of. We already read this one, too. Gotta be level 10. We're almost level 10. Gotta be level 5 and level 10. Can we please read this? You haven't reached the skill level. Need to. Oh, I need the skill level. Oh my god. I already know the comments are gonna be going crazy. Before you leave a comment, just 
I know you're gonna be like, it's not your reading skill, it's your it's your skill skill. So we need to improve our hunting skill. I didn't know that was a requirement. The joy of gutting. So I, again, I assume this is a hunting thing. What what level of hunting do I have to be to enjoy this book? What is my level of hunting right now? Because uh, we could go hunting. Because I'm d I'm willing to do whatever it takes. So hunting is level three, so maybe I got to get the level five. Well, let's go hunting. I mean, I'm sure there's uh, some woods over here. I mean, we could fast travel to a hunting ground. Isn't there like hunting grounds over here? Uh, let's just travel over here again and all right let's get on the horse well actually it's getting late in the day so we should sleep sleepy time another day over and we will sleep as long as possible until daytime get a nice so you know 11 hours of sleep Eleven hours. All right, that's good enough. Just wake up. Wake up. I'm also very hungry. Delicious. All right, Pebbles. Look at you, just waiting for me. Such a good boy. Alright. We travel back up. I think this is hunting ground over here. Yeah, it's a camp. Hmm. We can't really fast travel it to it, though. Activity giver. That's okay. We'll go up here. We'll go back up. We'll uh, go kill the... Humans and hey, you know what we could go get some meat while we're at it. Oh My lucky day my lucky day Well, hello there, sir You thought you could just Stop the road, huh? You thought you, you think you can do these things? Oh Hello from behind, huh? Oh, that's cute Hey, that's a lot of archers. That's the bad thing about not having a sword. Damn, you guys fall quick. Is there another one? Wow, there's so many humans. Ellie. And you're surrendering. God, you're such a coward. One versus what? Five? Oh, poor Boo. All right, anyways, as I was. Let's, oh, we can't get ears? Come on. Come on, give me a break. All right, well, let's just take the items that are 100 or more. Take the bacon, the bandages, dried meat. That's for the dog. Why can't we take their ears? Take the groshin. Lock pick, dried meat, leather gloves, anything that's like a hundred or more. And you guys uh, been having fun harassing, ooh, moonshine. Harassing the fine people, huh? Taking all their money. Damn cumins. Hunter's gloves, salami, groshin. Right, thank you. Thank you so much. Good job, buddy. There's another one over here. Come here. Where are you? There you are. 
Let's feed you. Look what I've got for you. You'll love it. We didn't feed them yet. Bacon. There you go. Good boy. Praise him too. That's my boy. Alright, did he... Is he gonna eat? Is that a glitch or something? Or are we just like talking to him too fast? Look what I've got for you. Just give him the bacon again. Here, eat it. Okay, there you go. Alright, and as we were. Man, it feels good. Getting all this loot. Fast travel. Gotta like tiptoe around all the dead bodies. It's good to leave their armor and some of their clothes on them because, um, you know, just to let the people know. In case other humans happen to show up, just let them know, hey, this is what happens if you terrorize our people. You die. You die. And I love this game so much. I'm having so much fun. <laughs> I think in the last like four or five episodes, maybe a little less, we have not advanced the story at all, which is fine by me. Oh, we also need to repair some of our armor after that battle. That little fight there. That little fight. We are now in town. And once we stop here, is a friend indeed. Oh, is that, um, find out how Fritz and Matthew are doing. Nice. Yeah, we'll do that for sure. But let's repair. Dang. Okay, I don't want to repair that. Repair that. There we go. Just like that. Boom. So let's see how Fritz is doing. Is it? Is that? Uh, where is that? Uh, it's green. Oh, so they're, they're over here. That's right. We're not nearby. All right, let's go to over here. Well, I never. Well, I never. This cool little tiered gardening there. I like it. It's really pretty. That's how I would do my garden if I lived on a slope. Kind of like a raised bed kind of thing. Yeah. Well, I never. Little pond there, it looks like. Oh, we're hungry. Well, that's okay. We have a ton of food, right? God, how are we hungry already? Oh, and we leveled up vitality. Ooh, what's berserker? As soon as your health falls to a minimum, you go berserk and you're stand. Uh, let's see. Blood rush. After beating your first opponent, your power of your attacks will increase for a while. Yes, that's really good. Yeah. Oh, and we uh, want to eat. That's the whole reason we went over here. So what do we... You know, let's eat mushrooms. Dried mushrooms. Salami. That's good enough. Right? Yep. That's good enough to hold us over. I don't, I don't like to eat the bacon or the dried meat because I usually give that to, um, mutt. We don't want to do that. Yeah, and we also want to try to get our hunting skill up. Good old hunting skill. Oh my god, I can't believe it's already been 54 minutes. No! Don't want it to end, guys. Alright, we're in the area. Let's go ahead and dismount. Dude, we're gonna be so strong. We have Savage. Uh, we got our new Vitality perk, which um, is like Bloodlust. So as soon as we kill the first guy. So, you're not welcome here. Get <laughs> 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 it up to here with these freaking dogs. <laughs> Oh, the dog counts for blood loss. Loss. Oh my god, that's so helpful. Nice. Oh, that's a lot of enemies. 
God, I'm in a tree. What the heck? Fight me on the open field. Mutt finished them all. Nice. It's hard to do combos when it's more than one person. There we go. Combo. Good job, Mutt. Good job. Yes. Yes. Give me that ear. Is he still fighting people? No. Thought Mutt ran off there, but yeah, look at all this loot. We'll just take it all. We'll just take it all. You're not going to need it. Ooh, Hungarian saber. Don't mind if I do. Alright, so that was one, two, three bodies. There's another one. I assume... There was four. I think maybe one ran away, unfortunately. In the chaos of that fight. Yeah, that's what it looks like. Alright, well, we cleared out the camp, so... Let's... Ooh, what is this? It's not better. It's better leg plate. Uh, let's move everything over. Hungarian Saber. Not better than what we have, but... We can definitely fix it up and sell it for more. Strength. That went up. Uh, give us Mule 3. It's just so useful. Can we carry everything now? It's 190. We have 280 worth of stuff. Oh my god, dude. We're about to make so much money. Not even funny. Not even funny. And that's everything. All right, let's repair what we can. Starting to run out of stuff. All right. Well, I was gonna say let's go hunting to try to improve our hunting skill, but that's okay. We won't do that. And we will now go back to Townburg, and that is where we will conclude this episode, guys. It's been a great episode. Our um, money is just going up and up and up, which is fantastic. We're making so much money. Uh, I think we're going to be able to rebuild the village very quickly. That is nice. That is really nice. Pretty soon we'll be a true knight. We'll have property of our own. That's when we become a true knight. Yeah. Let's 
get some more money. Good day. I've taken care of that. Have you brought me proof? Here it is. I'm delighted to hear it. Some charcoal burners came here from the camp to the south. I've seen their cubits camp there by the park. And they've been attacking folk in the area. Best go and check it out. Nice, another right. camp. I'll take a look around. I have some trophy. Show me. They deserved it. The All right, cool. Uh, so let's go to the bed and we can sleep and save it there. And like I said, we'll call it an episode. So guys, I appreciate you. Uh, now, uh, I do want to mention that uh, if you guys want to, you can become a YouTube member. When you become a YouTube member, you get a little uh, extra perks. You get a badge next to your name. You get access to member-only chats in my Discord. And I will also randomly select you guys to give you a bit of a shout-out. So, today's shout-out is Tor Torstein Bach. I appreciate it so much. He's been a Men at Arms for six months. So, big hey hey to you. I do appreciate it and I appreciate all my members. So, guys, thank you so much for joining me on this episode. This was so much fun, and I will see you next time on the battlefield.